Hi everyone, I'm Rob, the Country Traveller, and I'm going for another walk today with Edith, the miniature schnauzer. It's July, and we're walking near Fritham in the New Forest. But first... The trees that you'll see on the first part of the walk are beech trees. These are one of the native species in the forest and they can easily live to over 200 years old. Edith does a lot of sniffing, so she disappears from view for much of the time. In the autumn, the leaves of the beech trees turn red and orange and yellow, giving the forest those wonderful autumn colours. We'll come back again in the autumn to see that. On our right now, we're passing a plantation of fir trees. I'm not sure what kind of fir trees these are. They could be Douglas firs. They grow very tall. Edith knows that there's a stream coming up. She's turning into quite a water dog. She loves the water.
We're leaving the beech trees behind now. These are oak trees, another native species. These grow up to be the largest trees in the forest. Ahead of us now, we can see a group of New Forest ponies. Although the ponies seem tame, they are wild animals and they can kick and bite if they feel like it. We need to be a bit careful as we pass. They're all in very good condition. Coming up now is another pony with a foal. This is last year's foal, which is why it's so big. It's quite unusual for the foal to still be with its mother for this length of time. More beech trees here again. You may have heard me talking in another video about the self-seeded foxgloves growing on the sides of the paths in the forest. Well here's an example of that. These logs were cut down last year and are left on the side of the path to mature before being sold.
There's a wooden bench coming up on our right with some lovely carvings on the back of a badger and a fox, both of which live in the forest, but we're very unlikely to see them. They're mainly nocturnal animals. Here's another stream coming up for Edith to jump in. She doesn't seem so keen now. There's a pen here. I'm going to make a video on the New Forest Pony soon and I'll explain what that pen is used for then. As you can see, we're into another fir plantation here, with firs on both sides of us. This is interesting, we're coming up to a relatively new plantation of oak trees here which were planted in 1992 according to this plaque. If we assume that the oak saplings were about 10 years old when they were planted, the oaks in this uh, enclosure are now about 40 years old. That makes them still babies.
There's more timber along the sides of the path here waiting to be sold on. The timber is hard and straight grained and will be used in paper manufacture or in the construction industry. I hope you enjoyed this July walk with me and Edith through the forest. If you like the countryside and nature, please subscribe to our channel, The Country Traveller. Here's another couple of videos that might interest you.